and I'm Shana Gallimini. I live in Lincolnwood, a suburb of Chicago. I rescue feral cats. I started this in the end of seventh grade and I've rescued roughly around 300 to 400. Right before the holidays, I had 60 feral cats and kittens. The majority were kittens. It was a very bad kitten season this year. They can't find food, they're freezing. It's bad. For $50, I got my cats fixed, I got them shots, and I got them microchipped. I have no idea how much money I spent. I haven't even kept track. I don't even think about it. Uh, if I showed my dad the cats downstairs, he would freak out. He would leave. He said no more cats before we had any. So they kind of slipped in through the cracks. We have two dogs, a Yorkie, a Shepherd Collie Cattle Dog Mix, four pet cats, two birds, my rodent experiment in here. I've mixed gerbils, four different kinds of hamsters, and mice. My two bunnies over here, that's Lola and Stash, whatchamacallit. She's whatchamacallit because I couldn't have think what to call it. I had this ferret at work. Uh, I was playing with them a little bit too much. You should see them in the cats play. Oh, it's hilarious. You like feet more, don't you? Yeah, they're more entertaining. This is my favorite cat. Come here. Yeah, sure, my favorite is kitty. Nice butt shot. Feral cats uh, tend to stick with other cats, and they quickly want to become friends with these other cats. And then these other cats come up to me, get petted, get treats because they're getting petted, and the feral cats pick up on that. This kitty right here was trapped out of my own backyard. He was so mean, no one ever wanted to clean his cage. Um, we got him friendly by petting him with a yardstick, which sounds kind of bad, but he grew to like the touch. And now he's one of the friendliest cats we have. And he has a permanent mascot. This is Mr. Kuno. He is one of the kitties that I've just grown so attached to, I couldn't bear to give him away. And he helps so much with all the other kitties. It's okay. Yeah. It's okay.